thank you very much for the honour of choosing Bernardo's to be your partner charity. Thank you to BAPS for considering us and we've had some very fruitful discussions this evening about ways that we can work together. Bernardo's, as has already been said, has been around for just over 100 years and we've always been working with some of the most disadvantaged children in the UK. All children need a loving start in life. All children need to be cared for. And just coming here this evening and seeing the work you do with your children and seeing how many children are here this evening in the temple makes me realise that's at the very heart of what you believe too. And so I believe this is a national partnership here, is one founded on mutual values. Sadly, not every child in the UK today gets the sort of love and attention that we want to give our children. And that's where Bernardo's comes in. We work with children that need extra help and extra care. And we work particularly with children that other people may have forgotten about or given up on. I just want to tell you one story about Sarah, who I met not long ago. She was aged eight and she'd already had 10 foster parents. So 10 people she'd called mummy and daddy by the time she was eight. And she was a very challenging little girl who had some very disturbed behaviours, you can imagine. And the local authority felt that the only place for her was perhaps in a secure home where she couldn't run away, but where she wouldn't be able to call anybody mummy or daddy. And that's where Bernardo's came in. We work with some very splendid volunteers and foster parents, supporting them and helping them provide her with a home. And she's now been there for three years and is making excellent progress. But if we hadn't had those volunteers that help and support us, if they hadn't had the extra care and help that we're able to provide through our professional expertise, then I don't know what would have happened to that little girl. I dread to think. So we're honoured to be part of an organisation, to be a partner with an organisation that's won a Queen's Award for its work with children. You certainly do take children seriously and are well recognised for that. Honoured to be part of that and honoured to be a beneficiary of the BAPS challenge event. Uh, and I've been told to remind you, as if you haven't been reminded already, that it is a challenge uh, and that if you want to run, there's nothing to stop you. If you want to sprint, you can as well. Um, but for some of us a bit more longer in the tooth than walking the 10K may well be a challenge. But uh, I'm sure we're all up to it and all pushing ourselves for that. Every step you take on the challenge will be a step that we're able to make a difference with to a young person or child that we work with at Bernardo's. And it could be that the money that you raise will enable a child like Sarah to have a new step in her life. So when the going gets tough on the challenge, don't just remember your taskmasters here urging you on, but think of children like Sarah Children like your own children, who perhaps haven't got anybody to love and care for them, and think they'll be with you, cheering you on at the finishing line as well. So thank you for inviting us to be your partner. Thank you for agreeing to take part. Please do all you can that is legal to raise as much money as you can for the BAPS charities and for Bernardo's. And I look forward to seeing you and all your friends on the walk in April. Thank you very much.